Press the bell icon on YouTube and don't miss another update. Hello friends, in this column I discuss the desecration of the bodies of soldiers on the battlefield. This practice is as old as war itself. Yet, the governments and the warriors on the battlefield have always known that it was wrong and this has never been condoned by either of them. I begin with by narrating the, an episode from the Trojan War fought in the 12th century. An enraged Achilles slays Hector and then drags his body back to his camp. He leaves it to be eaten by dogs. Even the Greek gods are horrified at this brutality. They intervene to first preserve Hector's body and then prevail upon Achilles to return the body to his father for a proper burial. The Indian army has always conducted war as well as its counterinsurgency campaigns strictly as per the Geneva Conventions and the customary international law. This it has done despite grave provocations from the Pakistan army and the terrorists. However, two recent incidents have severely dented this image. I discuss these incidents in detail. There is a requirement for the Indian Army to give a formal explanation lest the impression be carried that the Indian Army has lost its moral compass.